I remember pulling up to the nightclub and I remember looking over at a car with these two guys sitting there. Initially, they had us do wet t-shirt contest and they had us do some um, mud wrestling. And that was my first customer. So it was my 19th birthday and that was, yeah, the beginning of a new life. We do have prostitution and yes we have a legal framework here in Holland. In my idea this system is not perfect, but maybe you could tell me another country in the world where they have a better system. There's an atmosphere of predation in the brothels. If you are now entering a brothel you can see some amazing things like alarm knots on the wall. I think a, an equivalent is to say we found child labor sweatshops, and the answer to it is to put a fan in the room. If we in the United States had gone down that path with slavery, we would never have gotten rid of the institution. You know, people say, well, you know, prostitution is just like McDonald's. You know, a woman has to go to work in a place that she doesn't like and where she gets all sorts of guff. Well, I say to that, at least in McDonald's, you're not the meat. I can't state this enough. It is everybody's kid. It's everyone's daughter. It's not, it's not just a runaway anymore. Her clothes had changed. Her hair and nails were being maintained. She wasn't coming home. She was 18 now. I couldn't make her come home anymore. They're coming at, at our youth from every direction. In total, uh, over a 12-year span, I spent $300,000 on porn. Demand drives the market. It's the revenue stream for human trafficking. To be bought and sold is horrible.